put y'all in the corner there so it's not as windy. But yeah, what's up? I'm fresh out the shower. It's almost time for a haircut. But yeah, as promised, I'm making a quick video uh, here on my vlog channel. Thank you to everyone that follows me on all social media for both my vlog account here and my main channel, The Boy Blue 91982. Both have their separate YouTube channels and social medias, you know what I'm saying? And uh, since I can't go live on my vlog channel, YouTube uh, channel, um, until May 9th, um, I'll be going live on TikTok, I guess. I need to be, I need to tell all my people. So if you're watching this on YouTube, I'm going to re-upload it to my uh, Instagram and YouTube. You know, you got to come follow me on TikTok on all three of my accounts. This one, Fred Spezio, then um, the Boy Blue 91982, and Juggalo Drama Alert. Just Google Juggalo Drama. You'll find our search Juggalo Drama on TikTok. Um, I need to grind harder, you know. I say that YouTube's my job, so I need to work harder at it, you know, to make more money. But um, that's another thing I wanted to touch on is, um, you know, battling depression, addiction, anxiety, you know. A lot of people pick on me, and they may feel that they're justified and think that I'm just a lazy piece of shit or whatever, you know. That's part of it. You know, but I, I'm literally, I got ADHD and whatnot. You know, I tried working in my early 20s. I'm 38 now, almost 39. What makes you think I'm going to get a real job? You know, YouTube is the only job I could, you know, continue keep making money on. So if you didn't know who I am, I'm, I'm, I've been known as an e-beggar for years now. I've been accepting donations before it was cool. Now if you're a creator, you more than likely take donations. I see a lot of creators here on TikTok have their cash app in the description, so I put mine there as well. You know, but um, shit, I take all forms of payment. Um, Venmo, PayPal, cash app. Um, Facebook payments, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get paid, son. And I'm trying to reach 10,000 followers on my main TikTok to uh, start making money on there. You know, I think I can go live and accept gifts. I can accept, if I accept and get enough gifts, then I think I can cash that in for money. I don't know what's the threshold. For, but, uh, yeah, I'm trying to get paid, fam. Mm. And, you know, when I get more views and more likes and comments and watch time and subscribers and all of that, you know, it makes me happy. It's scientifically proven. It releases endorphins in your brain. You know what I'm saying? It's an addiction. You know, so instead of drinking, I'm addicted to the Internet. You know, <laughs> I need to put more effort, but I'm always so depressed and I always feel so tired. I always put things off. You know, I'm a major procrastinator. And, you know, depression, like, I had to force myself to make this video here. Like, I'm putting on an, an act for you right now. You know, I'm literally morbidly depressed off camera. <laughs> no, but I, like, I'm one of those people that hides it with, you know, humor and what have you. You know, like, me and my mom are always joking around. I love hanging out with my sister. She's a riot, you know, but, um, I like that song by Allah Zoli Lou comes to mind. This song by Allah Zoli Lou comes to mind. Um, it's called Life. Let it fuck Because <laughs> life is a joke. Yeah, the hook goes, life is a joke. You'll lose your last breath as you laugh yourself to death. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah. So, I love Allah Zoli Lou. Praise Zul. Horns up. Yeah, so anyways. <clears throat> oh, Lil Kosis. What's up, man? Hey, thanks for watching. Yeah, but anyways, I'm going to try to uh, start streaming on TikTok more, you know, and, um, you know, I need to get more serious, get on a schedule, and start gaming more. Like, I finally, I have a PlayStation, I have internet, I never freaking stream gaming anymore. Like, I could be working on my gaming career, you know what I'm saying? But I never feel like, you know, like, uh... Like, the, like, up to, like I'll, I'll go live and listen to music and talk to the chat, you know? And then once I finally do that and get, you know, and talking to people, then, yeah, I'm cool. I can still be a little bit socially awkward, even online, but um, I'm more of an invert, you know? I like staying home inside and then playing on the internet, you know, and re-talking to people that way, you know, stay out of trouble, you know what I'm saying? But um, there was something else I wanted to say. 
Oh, yeah. So for any other recovering alcoholics or addicts out there, you know, um, try to get clean. Or if you're recovering, then props to you, you know. Uh, we need to lift each other up and stop, you know, just... There's, oh, that's another thing I wanted to talk about, the haters that just constantly hate day after day. And it's like they go out of their way and make it a point to try to attack you, like, nearly every day. And that's sad, you know. we got to pray for these people, you know. There's actually people like that on earth, you know what I'm saying? And it's a sad, sad thing, so. But my opinion, like, I'd made that video to that juggalette earlier this morning on my main TikTok. Um, you know, just ignore them. Block them. Don't feed the trolls and they'll go away, you know. So, I, I have a problem with that myself, too, sometimes, you know. But, um, they're just going to keep on, they're relentless, you know what I'm saying? And they're trying to trigger you, you know. So, don't let them trigger you. Don't let them get in your head and make you upset or angry or whatever, you know. It's not worth it, you know. They're just trolls on the internet. So, anyways, uh, Kosis, much clown love. Um, yeah, I'm going to go put this up on my YouTube and Instagram. So, thanks for watching. Much clown love, woo woo.